then you take the 5 ml round bottom flask and add 0.5 milliliter of phosphoric acid to it. You notice that I have about 0.5 ml phosphoric acid in here. So transfer that acid carefully. And then cover the acid jar. So you have taken 0.5 ml of phosphoric acid. What I would like you to do at this point is note the level of the liquid in the flask. So use the wax pencil and make a mark. So I'll just use a beaker to hold my round bottom flask. Then withdraw 2.5 milliliters of the starting material using a syringe as I told you before. Notice that the liquid level is a 2.5 ml or a 2.5 ml mark. Now transfer this starting material. To the 5 ml round bottom flask. Cover the jar and please place the syringe in a beaker provided. Now we have the starting material as well as the acid catalyst. You are going to connect this flask to the ring stand using the connecting rod. This is a rubber adapter. Now put the rubber adapter on the neck of the round bottom flask. Make sure it is firmly sitting inside the rubber adapter. Then you can clamp it. So we will be doing the dehydration reaction by heating this mixture. Not only will we be heating the mixture, we will be distilling off the product as the product is formed. So I need something that will act as a condenser. That is the purpose of this piece of glassware. So place this three-way connector on top of the black rubber adapter making sure that this is nicely aligned and again that there is no gap. Now what else do I need if I am distilling something? I need to note down the temperature at which the product is distilling. So I need a thermometer. I am going to insert the thermometer in the thermometer adapter in this fashion by gently rotating the thermometer and then attaching the thermometer adapter onto the top of the three-way connector. Make sure that the upper level of the mercury bulb here coincides 
with the lower level of the side arm. That is the right position for the thermometer to be in for distillation purposes. Again, the lower level of the side arm should be aligned with the upper level of the mercury bulb of the thermometer.